salmon back home in Spokane, a short taxi ride. The water in this bottle came from the Columbia River just below Chief Joseph Dam. This year, there are over half a million salmon coming back up to Columbia. About 100,000 more than expected are returning from their couple years journey to the Pacific Ocean. Now, the salmon swim hundreds of miles up the Columbia River and around nine dams on their way home. At the peak of the season, tens of thousands swim past the dams each day. They swim until they reach Chief Joseph Dam, 125 miles down from the Spokane their home. Today there is no way for the salmon to swim past Chief Joseph. They try every possible way to go around Chief Joseph Dam. Imagine this water is the tens of thousands of salmon looking for a way to get beyond Chief Joseph Dam this year. How can they get home? Well, a taxi ride will do. This year can be the first year salmon return to Spokane after about 112 years. Just a few salmon this year would be a good start. They have lived in Spokane for thousands of years and want to be back home today. How to make this happen? Catch a few of the thousands of salmon at Chief Joseph Dam. The salmon can be caught near the dam between Bridgeport, Brewster, and the Okanagan River. Put the live salmon in a container of cool water and taxi them home to Spokane. Once home, set them free in the Spokane River near Latok Creek, one of, their or one of their favorite spawning grounds. Next year, even more can come back home. Imagine in the water seeing tens of thousands of salmon swimming home in Spokane. Imagine seeing tens of thousands of freaking fish out there, it'd be awesome. It would be cool. God, we could come down here and eat lunch. That would be awesome. That's how it should be. There's a great blue heron looking down his nose As he checks the silver in the morning sun Paddles splashing and the muskrat splashing The kingfish scream as the salmon runs Sailing down a silver ribbon Autumn colors 